we're back previewing some properties here in Kensington. Uh, lovely home. I love this area still. There's a elementary school down the street. And yeah, like some people are working on the roof. But we're going to preview this property right here. Let's take a look. Nice numbers. Freshly renovated. Love that they kept the original fireplace and the original windows here. They did upgrade the rest of them. I, that, I don't like that, but in some of the older houses, you, you do, that's your only way of getting AC in the property. Let's turn on the rest of the lights. Nice and bright, nice and large. Island, little nook area. First bedroom here. Walk-in closet. You know how I feel about those. Bathroom, so this is your, assuming this is the primary. Like this. Single sink. Should have been a double, but it's okay. There's your garage, your little backyard. Slide, let's go take a look at the other bedroom. Here's a front facing bedroom. Laminate flooring. Full bath. Love that Spanish style look. Gold or copper fixtures. And here's the third bedroom in the middle with the walk in closet. Neat fan. I don't know if I like this much just because I feel like. There's not enough space here. I would almost, I could have even appreciated more of a L from here. And a nail right here, and then you could have your stools right here or something like that. But this is wide enough, but I feel like that's not. So you kind of lose the entertaining spot on this side. One thing that this doesn't have is a neighbor fence. So you get to see your neighbor every morning and say hi. Now in North Park here at this property, right on the corner of Utah and Howard, half a block away from El Cajon Boulevard. A lot of traffic, but it's a good looking home. I feel like it's a, a house that just stay that people, a house in the middle of the city where they just build around it. I don't know if there's any power. It's a cute traditional home. Small kitchen, electric stove, little reading area, back side, side backyard. Looks like this might have been the main entrance at one point. It was, and they looks like they closed the gate there, and then now they're using the side door. Hmm. I would actually rather close that out, keep this as an entrance. But Bolted ceilings, traditional wood burning and gas. Bedroom number one. This is a two bedrooms, two bath. 
original wood flooring. Closet with the little window. Washer and dryer. I like this original hardware with the skeleton key. The coat closet. Your one bed, your one bath for your linens here. More storage space. The original hardware. And then you have your second bedroom. And this one is facing your side backyard and then looks like there's an attachment the garage there. We'll go outside shortly. Going to the garage. I guess there's a single car garage. We'll go the other way. Very cool home. The only thing I don't like is that it is a busy street. And then there's apartments or complexes next door. I wish they would have kept this main entrance here. Well, Very neat home. I wish the location was a little different, but it's a great property. You can tell the vintage garage next door, single. Sometimes I look and see if there's any classic cars in there. Okay. All right, so that's the end of our preview and properties today. Gonna just run some errands and grab some food. And we'll keep moving. Today is a coffee day, a workout of a coffee shop day. One of our go to spots is uh, James Coffee here in Little Italy. time scheduling our euro trip for 2023 looking forward to going over the pond again 